Welcome back. Matt's with us again, this time with a sweet treat. Vanilla bean, nice cream, with apple cider poached pears, and cacao. Here's what you need to follow along. You need some frozen bananas, organic apple cider, cinnamon sticks, star anise, fresh orange juice, honey, pears, butter, a vanilla bean pod, and 70% dark cacao. Matt, this looks like a great summer treat. It looks delicious. Why do we call it nice cream instead of ice cream? Well, you started it off right away, Trace, by saying sweet treat. So the good news is, is yes, it's a sweet treat and it's nice cream instead of ice cream because it is made with beautiful frozen bananas. So, you know, there's no added sugar. Mind you, our cacao, so if somebody wants to keep and omit sugar completely, don't finish it with cacao, that's fine. But you've got really healthy dessert here. So first off, you want, you want to do is you're looking for ripe bananas, something that's gonna caramelize nicely. It's got a nice little sort of umami taste to it, a nice little sweetness taste to it, if you will. So I've put them in the freezer for around three hours. I've peeled them first, put them in a the freezer, chopped them up, they're ready to go in our food processor. First, we wanna do our poaching liquid. So we started with bosque pears, great seasonal produce. It's the end of summer, this is beautiful. What I wanna do is I wanna shave it first and I wanna uh, peel back all of that skin. Only reason being, you don't have to, but it permeates a little better with poaching liquid. Uh, orange juice and also our quarter cup of honey going in. Cinnamon sticks, we've got two cinnamon sticks going in. We've got star anise and we're just gonna set that on a simmer because the power of TV, I've got some pears that I've poached off. You wanna poach them for about an hour and a half. What I'd like to do too is trim the bottom so it sits nice and flush when you're about to present it. So we've got our pear in. You can keep rotating it as time goes and need be. I'm taking a vanilla bean. This is a beautiful Madagascan, beautiful vanilla bean. Yeah, I wish you could smell this. So what you wanna do, and I'm sure your viewers know, our viewers know, because everyone's pretty savvy cooks, but you wanna split it and then we're just gonna slide our knife and we're gonna take all of that beautiful essence of that fresh Madagascar um, vanilla bean. So that is just stunning right there. Keep that back as well, because what you can do is you can infuse that in teas, you can put that in milk, you can keep that. So I'm gonna save that bean for another use. So if we want, we can add just a little bit of our organic apple juice as well, just to give it a little bit of, um, a little bit of room there. And our food processor is gonna make our nice cream right away. And we get right into our plating stage. So here we go. So we've got our nice cream ready to go, which is gonna be beautiful. This is almost like, they call it essentially like a banana soft serve. I like to pour a little bit of our reserve liquid. So once you've finished po uh, poaching your pears, Trace, what you wanna do is set that, let that reduce a little bit further. As you can see with my pear, it's now been poached for an, an hour, hour and a half roughly. You want a knife to be able to go through that beautifully. So I've got my poaching liquid, I've got my pear, okay? And we're just gonna finish this with a little bit of our beautiful 72% cacao. I might drizzle over a little more of that liquid. And like this is a super, super, super healthy and fun dessert. What you could do too, Trace, is by all means, you could finish that with a little whipped cream just to spice it up a bit. But there it is. That is a beautiful poached pear, seasonal dish, ready to go and a healthy dessert for you. Looks fantastic and uh, good for the waistline. Thank you, Matt.